Hey guys, so now I am going to show you practically how to fill up the online application form for the Assam Teachers Eligibility Test 2021. Now I am practically the form of the online abedon for home tutor. Now I had made, I had earlier made a video on the uh, various criteria of the examination. So if you haven't seen the video, uh, please do watch it uh, so now let's begin hmm. first of all to apply online we need to log into their official website which is ssasam.gov.in so i'm going to click it here okay so various options have popped up then uh, look at official website to click on this one yet link to the so my first link to the click on uh, so this is their official page the, uh, of Assam Sarva Siksha Abhiyan Mission. So here it is clearly written uh, that click here to apply online. So uh, apply koi bola hole, a option to tamik click koi bola uh, Now I had mentioned in my earlier video that those of you want a detailed knowledge about the syllabus and the advertisement, you can download it from the official website. So this is here it is the lower primary upper primary uh, you can download it okay whichever you want and this is the advertisement uh, file you can download it from here from this link you can download the advertisement file okay uh, to get a detailed knowledge okay uh, i'm not downloading it now because i have already downloaded it earlier so i will directly click on the application form link okay uh, so now this will redirect, redirect me to the application form so this is the application form take on this application form mm, it, actually even application form no hai, it to uh, main page hoi uh, application form to yaad click kora piece of time ipam take on table for okay go cover page will you go over here uh, this is the cover page where they have uh, mentioned two points that candidate has to first register by filling the application form and secondly candidate can then log in using application number or username and password okay so prathamote ami jikhetu pratham fresh candidate so ami prathame register kori bo lagibo application form khono yaad tipe palai yaad click kori palai and secondly ami uh, ekhon fill up kora pisot ami eta application number by username pam aru password pam je d to d ya tami ako login kori pelai further process to koribo lagibo jene online payment uh, ba kiba future ot kiba updation ahile yat login kori ami koribo lagibo okay etu prothom yat ami jetia click koribo lagibo jetia ami first fresh candidate hoy okay so uh, if we are a fresh candidate, we have to click on this application form and fill in the details after which we will be given an application number or username and a password uh, by using them uh, we can we can uh, use them for future references okay for various purposes like making the online payment or uh, for any other uh, future updations okay so as we are a fresh candidate um, like me i am a fresh candidate now so i will click it here okay so this is the application form here we can see after clicking the application form here uh, several uh, points are given that is there are uh, many number of points like uh, there are 14 number of points so Mm -hmm. I suggest you uh, that you make sure you go through all of them carefully because it is necessary to avoid mistakes okay uh, so I will not go through them uh, but I suggest you that whenever you fill up the application form you go through these points okay mm -hmm. don't skip them uh, now the steps for application form are fill up the application form then verify the correctness and the entries made in the application form before submit then login with the application number and password 
then make the uh, online payment and then take the print out of the application form so prathamote ami application form kon fill up korim tar pisor verify kori pelai submit button to dobabo lagibo tar pisor ami ako he agor page khonot jam tate ami application number aro password di login koribo lagibo tar pisor ami online payment to korim tar pisor ami print out to liam so etia ami tololoi jao uh, so now we will go to the next page okay let's continue to the no next page okay so this is the next page here we can see three options yeah tinita option dia ase lower primary upper primary are both lp and up so those of those of you who wish to apply for the lower primary can click it here those of you who wish to apply for the upper primary can click it here and those of you who wish to apply for both can click it here जुने जुने lower primary कोरी बो तेहुं याद टीपी बो जुने upper primary कारने कोरी बो ME school कारने तेहुं लोगे याद टीपी बो आरो जुने LPRO ME दूटा कारने apply कोरी बो तेहुं लोगे याद टीपी बो ओके the format is somewhat same uh, the only difference is that um, in case of lower primary there is no specific subject you don't have to make a subject selection but in case of upper primary you have to make subject selection uh, between social studies and uh, uh, mathematics uh, and science okay mathematics and science or social studies so uh, i personally i personally uh, will go for the upper primary and not lower primary okay so now uh, we have to fill up the application form like this so first of all, uh, we have to type the candidate's name. Secondly, the candidate's father's name. Then, the candidate's mother's name. Then, if the candidate has any local guardian and is residing out of station, then he or she can uh, mention the guardian's name. Okay, local guardian's name here. Uh, I don't have to mention it because I am presently residing in my own home. So here I have to. Uh, the, here we have to mention the candidate's date of birth. That is, we have to select it here directly. This is the month, sorry, this is the month, uh, this is the year, and this is the date, okay, now then we have to mention the gender, we have to click it here, uh, yeah, gender to male, female, to select Koribo Legibo Tarpisa address. Now we have to type the address. Okay. Now we have to type the city, then we have to select the district, here are 34 numbers of district, uh, myself I belong to Tinsukia, so I will select Tinsukia and then the state, Assam, okay, then here we have to give the pin code, then here we have to type the mobile number, Again, you have to type any alternate number if you have any. Okay, then we have to mention the email address.
then we have to select the nationality that is Indian here again we have to mention the Aadhaar number okay Aadhaar number You fill up the particulars very carefully so that you avoid making any mistakes okay okay so this was the personal information now we have to select a zone or district for the examination subject medium language okay uh, I have told in my earlier video that uh, we have to select according to the we have to select a, a zone okay so in the advertisement it is mentioned in detail so these are the zones okay there are seven number of zones so the appointment procedure will be based on this zone applied by the candidate okay for example if i belong to Sinsukia and i would like to get uh, appointment in this district okay uh, as my district is mentioned here so one zone has many districts okay so zone 4 i have to uh, i have to click it here for uh, getting appointment in either of these any of these districts okay I may get appointment in any of these districts so because my home district is Sinsukia so I am going to select zone 4 okay so uh, to more home district Sinsukia hoy so my zone 4 to select korin uh, hokolwe nizor nizor Kubida mote zone to select koribo. A zone selection or uporote apuna lukor appointment dia hobo. Okay. Etia mm, choice of district for examination. Now we have to select the center for examination. So here are 33 number of districts. So my district is Sinsukia. So I will select it Sinsukia. okay that is number 31 then specify subject if applying for paper 2 so this is the main point this is the difference between the lower primary and the upper primary one okay uh, in case of lower primary we don't have to fill up this point in case of paper 2 either we have to select mathematics and science teacher or social studies i will go for social studies okay so now medium of test booklet so this is uh, this question is about the question question book uh, or a question paper which you will get in the, during the examination so uh, you can select your preferred language okay in which you want to get the question paper so i will select it here english here are five languages that is assamese uh, bengali boro hindi and english so five languages are available so you can choose any one of them and first of all uh, uh, sorry uh, and the last one is first language that is uh, language one uh, which i had mentioned in my earlier video that is the mil or the mother tongue so i am going to select it hindi here are one two three four five six eight eight number of options given eight numbers of op eight number of options given so you have to select any one of them and uh, i personally will select hindi okay so now if you have if you uh, fall under any reservation category okay like category of the candidate if your uh, category if you are general candidate then you have to select it here if you are an sc you have to select it here if you are uh, scheduled tribe 
planes then you have to select it here if you are scheduled drive hills then here and if you are obc or mobc you have to click it here okay so are you physically challenged no i am not physically challenged so i will select it here and religion here it's islam so now after filling up the reservation section then comes the educational qualification section so first of all here we can see prathome ami dekhi pole pam hsslc tar mane higher secondary or equivalent that is 10 plus 2 thik ache i belong from art stream so i will be selecting arts okay and the course was regular now here we have to put the total marks obtained out of total marks then the percentage will pop up on its own then we have to manually put the roll number so here i put my roll number then the date of passing in the board or university okay <clears throat> similarly in the graduation section also i belong from arts regular and total marks obtained out of the percentage will pop up on its own now here have to enter my roll number in the date <clears throat> in the institution or university again in case of post graduation also i have to select the stream i had undergone and i had undergone the post graduation course from distance learning so i am choosing this option now again i have to put in the roll number this okay and date of passing in the institution is to go to university okay now and now comes the professional qualification so i am not pursuing i am an already passed out candidate so here i will select uh, i had undergone this course 2 years diploma in elementary education so i am going to select this point uh, that is number 1 hmm. tumaloke nijor subidha mote juntu course tumaloke loisa juntu course undergo korisa e course to select koriba uh, moi jehetu डिएलएड करीसो सो मैं डिएलएड तो सिलेक्ट कर द डिटेल्ड इनफॉरमेशन रिगार्डिंग दिस सेक्शन इज गिवन इन द एडवर्टाइजमेंट इटसेल्फ सो यू कैन रेफर टू दैट ओके नाउ कमिंग टू दिस फॉर्म आई एम सिलेक्टिंग टू इयर डिप्लोमा इन एलिमेंट्री एडुकेशन देन माय टोटल मार्क्स ऑप्टेन्ड out of my percentage then the roll number the date of sorry the roll number then the date of passing the year of admission the institution okay so i had filled up the form and the mode of course was regular okay now comes the 
photo and the signature uploading section so here some points are given regarding the photo and the signature so make sure you go through them okay before uploading so now i will upload my photo okay now again here i will upload my signature a homo document mo upload kori photo aru mo signature mo upload korilu apnaloge dekhi paise yate mo mo photo aru signature upload korilu tar pisot yate ami ta password dibo lagibo um now here we have to put in the login details that is uh, the password for future reference so i'm going to um, select a password Okay. Now, after putting in the password, uh, the, uh, the last section is the declaration made by the candidate, where I have to tick this point. Okay, we have to select this point because without selecting it, we cannot submit the form. Okay. Now, we will continue submitting. So here, a box popped out. Before click on submit button, candidate should verify the entries made in the application form. There is no provision to make changes in the application form, so make sure all the entries are correct. Okay. So now, uh, since my entries are all are okay, so I am going to select okay. I think this site is having some problem that is why Okay So now guys I had made us small mistake uh, before submitting i have to upload the pass certificate of my professional qualification which i didn't do that's why the form didn't uh, got submitted so now i will choose the file here now i have uploaded it now again i will go to the submit option okay, okay. okay now my form has been submitted successfully now uh, this is the next page which i got after submitting my application form now uh, this is the username or application number for my future reference i have to use it for my future reference and now currently i have to use this for my, uh, the payment option okay now click here for login and here go for payment so uh, uh as mentioned in the advertisement the payment for one paper is 300 so i'm going to pay it online so now this is the payment of page here i will opt 
for the UPI ID so here I will make payment through an UPI ID so right. I am going to proceed with the payment so it's processing so here I am going to enter my personal UPI ID Now, as we can see, after clicking on the make payment option, I have received a payment confirmation message on my personal mobile, mobile number. So, I am going to pay it from my own mobile and then I will come back to the form. Sorry guys, unfortunately my bank server is down, so I have to cancel this. So guys, earlier unfortunately my payment got declined, so uh, I'll try to make the payment <coughs> again by logging in with the application number. As this is the second time I'm logging in uh, to make the payment, so I did not have to fill in the application form again uh, because I have already submitted it earlier uh, and that was successful and after which I have received the uh, application number so with that now I am going to log in again uh, that is the application number and the password which I have received in my mobile number like this. Okay, now I'll log in again. Okay, now this is the page. You can see the payment status is still pending as uh, my uh, payment was unsuccessful last time. So I will uh, retry. So this is the page which you will get after successfully filling up the application form. So I will click it here for the next step that is payment. So now this is the uh, payment page so now you can select there are various options here so you can select whichever you want like credit card debit card ATM pin internet banking etc okay so I'm going to select the UPI option so here it goes now I will proceed with the payment now here you have to enter your UPI ID You can enter any UPI ID, Google Pay, Google Pay, Phone Pay. Sorry. Okay, now make payment. Now, after clicking on the Make Payment option, uh, you will receive a confirmation message on your mobile number linked with the bank account. So, with that, you have to make the payment so I am going to make the payment from my mobile itself
so it's processing okay now my payment is done it's successful now so you can see online payment transaction is successful so i have successfully made the payment so now i also have received another message in my mobile for successful online payment okay so here i have completed the process for filling up the uh, or applying the teachers eligibility test so now again if i log in with my credentials here here we can now you can see this the payment status is successful so now the last and the final process is that now i have to um, take out a print out uh, for the uh, sorry take out a print out of the application form forms for future reference okay no for print out i have to as i don't have a printer so i'll print out uh, afterwards mm. now so this is the process total process which which you have to do uh, in order to fill up the application form and make the payment okay i hope you all could get it properly and i hope i could make it clear to you all aha koru je apunaluke sampurna process tu buji pale so video tu bhal lagile like share subscribe koribo if you like my video then please like share and subscribe